Tell me how excited you are to be one of the beneficiaries of this great business. Okay, actually I see it as a great opportunity right. because um, it gives us an opportunity to grow even in the industry. Mm -hmm. I'm, a, I'm into cleaning um, business. Oh, okay. Yeah, I look into janitorial business as a whole. So it's, it's an opportunity to grow. It's an opportunity to create an awareness. Mm -hmm. I was so thrilled about the aspect that has to do with the marketing, digital right. marketing. Right. And then that's something I actually want to work on and see how I can actually spread my tentacle. I would like to say very quickly that this is a very wonderful thing that the senator is doing. Uh, it's an eye-opener. It's, uh, I mean, um, a, a enabling and empowering young entrepreneurs like me. This is very fantastic. Well, it's, um, it's, a, it's so enlightening. A lot of things that I get to know that um, unusually being a, a founder of a business, I don't, really, I didn't know more about it, but there's enlightenment to it. I'm knowing too well that the senator could just make himself available to get things close to SME. It tells a lot. It tells a lot. In any case, it's a big opportunity to be here this morning. It has been so exciting. Um, senator Abiru has been a fantastic person. I'm meeting him for the first time today. Interestingly, at the shell there. He was talking to me and we were, you know, relating, talking freely about what he has put together. He has done so well for a lot of people this morning, about 1,000 people. I mean, it's not an easy thing. And how I wish so many of these senators out there are trying to do this kind of thing. You see, trying to empower people. It could have been awesome. It could have been, you know, it would be, be a leverage on the efforts that people are making right. from time to time. Right. So for him to have done this, I give him kudos. It also give you an opportunity to create job opportunity for younger people right. who are actually working with you. So it's 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 a very good place to be. I I see it as a great privilege. With the whole concept of the the the, the points, the point at which the point lines they brought up is something that we need as an SMEs, which means that these are areas we need to key into to help us digitally in terms of adversary in terms of funding and all this and also registration of business so looking at it is very sustainable if one can key into these procedures i think it will help you um you know be strong enough to to face the challenges being an entrepreneur you know at the time this pandemic started every business collapsed yes. my business is one of those ones that had challenges problems you know I had a, a staff of about 12, it has to be reduced to about 4. At the time, there is no business at all. And it's, it's a fallout of that time now that we are still experiencing. So for Senator Ade Tokumbo to have put up to this kind of program, this workshop, this seminar, you know, to uh, the, uh, leverage on the situation that we find ourselves and to, you know, want to take a lot of people out of this trouble, out of the doldrum about their businesses, I think I commend him very much. Okay. Sincerely, seeing someone making that sacrifice, putting so much and selfless kind of thing and spending the whole time with us to make sure that he's on ground, gives a lot of people hope that we have people who are coming on board that will act like what the youth wanted because we want people that have fresh mind and all that to support what it takes to um, be nation building.